Hello guys, today we are going to fix uh, Nox in uh, after treatment one intake Nox data drifted high. This is Cascadia 2016 or oh, sorry 2019. So there's a code pop up uh, for intake Nox sensor. It's most likely we have to replace it, but before we replace it, we should do the region. We're gonna do the park region, then we're gonna try. I tried to clear, uh, clear it, but it didn't clear it's a permanent inside so we're gonna start the truck and do the region we're gonna try doing a SCR TPF region okay So park region is started as you can see the check engine is gone so check engine is not there but uh, still we have to wait until the region cleared out or if it didn't clear out if the code is still there that means we need to replace uh, knock sensor inlet but we're gonna wait until this region uh, done so I'm gonna come back when the region is completed so the park region is complete you can see here DPF Regeneration service completed. So we are press OK. So it took like almost 46 minutes. So the park region is complete. So and uh, there is uh, no check engine. You can see there is no check engine, and the region is complete. So there is not nothing wrong with the knock sensor. Maybe probably sometime what happen is just the def quality if you have a bad def quality so the knock sensor is gonna throw this code knock sensor drifted high like that if your uh, if your def quality is not good try using a def with the with the can the one one come with the like a gallon one plastic gallons try using them they are the good so Park region is complete, so there's nothing wrong with that. If the problem comes back again, so then we need to change uh, Knox sensor inlet. So, if there's a problem comes, I will make another video how to change a Knox sensor inlet and how to test Knox sensors. We can also test with the DD15 program, original program. We can test the Knox sensors. I'm gonna make another video. To show you guys how to check knock sensors one by one with the computer if they are good if they are reading good or not thank you for watching my video if you like this video if it's helped you please comment below to tell me that uh, your problem was fixed thank you for watching my video